Next tonight, a piece of artwork is at the centre of a censorship row after it was removed from public display amid claims it distresses children. Called the Crucifixion of Mankind, it's a wood carving by artist Connor Barrett. He lived in Colchester and gifted the piece to Colchester Borough Council. And here it is, hanging in the town's library where it had been for 40 years, until, that is, it was put into storage. Former Colchester MP Sir Bob Russell was told it was because of the graphic depiction of a baby impaled on a sword which distressed children and parents. Essex County Council says it's received a number of complaints. Yes, it has been controversial over the years, but a lot of art is controversial. I don't like modern art, but I don't say you shouldn't display it. He gave this to the people of Colchester, and I frankly don't think it's acceptable for censorship anywhere, certainly not in a public building, a library. I think that sadly what it demonstrates is an increasing lack of understanding of our great Christian heritage. These stories that were once so clearly understood and had real meaning and purpose at the heart of a library are now no longer understood. Well, the council say that new services being provided at the library have made the location of the piece inappropriate and in a statement they told us, having received a number of complaints about this particular artwork due to its proximity to our new registration office, which deals with very sensitive cases, including child bereavement, we felt the location of the picture was not the most appropriate. And they've also said they're looking for somewhere new to display it. Well, we asked what you thought about the decision on our Facebook page and it appears that uh, most of you don't agree with it being taken down. Tom McLaughlin said it's been there for 40 years. I'm 36 now, so more than my lifetime. I've always been fascinated by it and it never scared me or anyone I know as a child. Well, Keith Wallace agrees, saying this is art and it's been there for 40 years. Come on, leave it in place. But Kaylee Bartlett says she can see both points. It's upsetting if you know what you're looking at, but if some people are like me, you wouldn't have even realised. And thanks very much for all your responses.